You're watching TVC News at 7. Utilization of qualified, qualified local content manpower is a cost reduction strategy of the NCDMB aimed at creating employment for thousands of Nigerians in line with President Mohamed Buhari's vision for job creation in the country. Well, this exactly was the message of Nigeria's Minister of State, Petroleum Timmy Perceiver after visiting the 17-story headquarters building of the Nigeria Content Development and Monitoring Board in Yenagoa. We have more in the report. Nigeria's Minister of State Petroleum was welcomed to the office of the NCDMB at Opolo. After viewing the prototype at the office of the NCDMB, Timmy Press Silva decided to go to the Oxbow Lake area to see the 17-story headquarters building of the Nigeria Content Development Monitoring Board, which stands in Yenagoa as a testament of local content development in the country. This is actually a clear demonstration of what Nigerians can do in Nigeria. And uh, this is encouraging to the NCDMB to be able to engage other local contractors as well, because we are encouraged to patronize more local contractors. This is a clear definition, and I now understand what local content means. When we started, uh, we took almost about 50 youths from the host community uh, that had no skill. Uh, we trained them in carpentry, in masonry, in laying of tiles. Today, those youths are working on this facility. And I believe because of the competency and the skills that they have acquired, uh, the contractor himself will take them to other projects. The 17-story building offers much more than administrative and operational functions of the NCDMB. This building is a, is a testament to uh, that impressive uh, performance record. You see a lot of oil and gas events going to Abuja, going to Lagos. But we now have a befitting facility here. I think that going forward we will see a lot of uh, oil and gas related activities in Niger Delta, which will be good for us. There are plans to rent out some of the floors to reputable corporate organizations, particularly the ones that are related to oil and gas activities. Uh, currently we have about two applications for some operating companies that want to occupy some of the space that we have here. So we have a plan for sustainability of this facility and also a long-term maintenance plan. Competence usually attracts commendations. The ES of the NCDMB came in from Shell, so it's bringing a, a new culture into the public space, and that's what we are seeing. This is the kind of uh, synergy that we want to uh, develop between uh, the private sector and public sector. The facility will be ready for inauguration in December. Ovietime George, TVC News, Yenagoa.